love, a complex and often tumultuous journey can be clouded by the allure of a charismatic partner. However, beneath the surface of charm and confidence, a darker personality trait may lurk, narcissism. Characterized by an inflated sense of self-importance, a lack of empathy, and an excessive need for admiration, narcissism can be a destructive force within a relationship. Recognizing the red flags of narcissism is crucial for protecting your emotional well-being and fostering healthy connections. Before delving into the red flags, it's essential to grasp the core characteristics of narcissism. While not everyone exhibiting narcissistic traits is a full-blown narcissist, understanding these tendencies can provide valuable insights. Grandiosity Narcissists often have an exaggerated sense of their importance, believing they are superior to others. Need for admiration. Constant validation and praise are essential to their self-esteem. Lack of empathy. They struggle to understand or share the feelings of others. Entitlement. Narcissists believe they deserve special treatment and privileges. Exploitativeness. They often take advantage of others to achieve their own goals. Red flags to watch for. Excessive self-focus. A narcissistic individual is primarily concerned with their own needs, desires, and accomplishments. Their conversations often revolve around themselves with little interest in your thoughts or feelings. Lack of empathy. Pay attention to how your partner responds to your emotions. A narcissist may dismiss your feelings, invalidate your experiences, or even use your emotions against you. Grandiose sense of self, overinflated ego, and a constant need to be the center of attention are classic narcissistic traits. They may exaggerate their achievements or downplay your successes. Entitlement and manipulation. Narcissists often believe they deserve special treatment and may manipulate others to get their way. They may exploit your kindness or generosity. Criticism and blame shifting. To maintain their inflated self-image, narcissists may criticize others, including you, to feel superior. They often shift blame for their mistakes onto others. Love bombing. In the early stages of a relationship, a narcissist may shower you with attention, affection, and compliments. This intense love bombing can be intoxicating but is often followed by a devaluation phase. Jealousy and Possessiveness Narcissists often exhibit extreme jealousy and possessiveness, viewing their partner as an extension of themselves rather than an independent individual. Lack of Accountability they struggle to take responsibility for their actions and may blame others for their mistakes or failures. Gaslighting. Narcissists may engage in gaslighting, a manipulative tactic that makes you question your own sanity and perception of reality. Protecting yourself. Recognizing the red flags of narcissism is the first step towards protecting yourself. If you suspect you're involved with a narcissist, consider the following. Set boundaries. Establish clear boundaries and enforce them consistently. Prioritize self-care. Focus on your emotional and mental well-being. Seek support, talk to friends, family, or a therapist about your concerns. Trust your instincts. If something feels off, it probably is. Remember, healthy relationships are built on mutual respect, empathy, and support. If your partner consistently exhibits narcissistic behaviors, it may be time to reevaluate the relationship for your own well being. Understanding the love bombing phase Love bombing is a common tactic used by narcissists to reel in their victims. It's a period of intense adoration, flattery, and idealization designed to create an emotional dependency. While it can be intoxicating, 
it's essential to recognize the underlying manipulation. Characteristics of love bombing. Over-the-top compliments, excessive attention, promises of a perfect future, mirroring your interests and values, and rapid escalation of the relationship. Why it's dangerous. Love bombing creates an emotional high, making it difficult to see the red flags. It can also lead to a sense of obligation or fear of losing the perfect partner. The devaluation phase, a downward spiral. Once the narcissist has secured their partner's emotional investment, the devaluation phase begins. This is when the mask slips and the true nature of the relationship emerges. Tactics of devaluation, criticism, gaslighting, silent treatment, triangulation, involving a third party to create jealousy or insecurity, projection, blaming their own shortcomings on the partner, and emotional withdrawal. Impact on the victim. The devaluation phase can be emotionally devastating, leading to feelings of confusion, self-doubt, and isolation. Victims may question their own sanity and worth. Breaking free from the narcissistic cycle. Leaving a narcissistic relationship can be challenging due to the emotional manipulation and fear tactics employed by the abuser. However, it's essential for your well-being. Recognizing the cycle. Understanding the patterns of idealization, devaluation, and discard can help you identify when you're being manipulated. Building a support system. Connect with friends, family, or support groups who can offer emotional support and guidance. Setting boundaries. Establishing clear boundaries with the narcissist can help protect your emotional well-being. Seeking professional help, therapy can provide valuable tools for healing and rebuilding your self-esteem. Creating a safety plan. Develop a plan for leaving the relationship safely, including securing financial resources and housing arrangements. Healing and recovery. Recovering from a narcissistic relationship takes time and effort. Focus on rebuilding your self-esteem, reconnecting with loved ones, and establishing healthy boundaries. Self-care. Prioritize physical and emotional well-being through exercise, healthy eating, and relaxation techniques. Building resilience. Develop coping mechanisms to manage stress and anxiety. Forgiveness. Optional consider forgiving yourself for staying in the relationship, but remember that forgiveness doesn't mean forgetting or condoning the abuse. Learning from the experience. Reflect on the relationship to identify red flags and develop healthier relationship patterns for the future. Remember, you are not alone. Many people have experienced narcissistic relationships and healing is possible. By understanding the dynamics of narcissism and taking steps to protect yourself, you can reclaim your life and build healthier connections.